Hello. Hey, I see a couple of you are on already. Awesome. Let me know if you can hear me okay. Hey, Rita. All right. We are live. Let's get the chat open here. Hey, who else is on? I see Rita's on. Sorry about that. Tracy, hey. I hope everybody's having a great week. And the other Tracy. <laughs> Hi, Lisa. Well, I got a lot of my creators on tonight. That's awesome. We had um, one person. Hey, Gloria. A new person join our team tonight. Um, Magnolia is doing a extra gift if you join um, my team tonight. Hey, Rita. And... Um, they're actually, besides all the wonderful things that come in the summer creator kit, the creator enrollment, enrollment kit, they are actually adding this awesome stencil um, if you join today by midnight Eastern time. Yay, Tracy! The Faith Family Freedom Stencil, which I used a while back to create this. So if any of you have been thinking about uh, joining our team Magnolia Monarchs. Um, even if it's just to get the discount on your own product, um, or if you want to make a little extra money, if you join tonight on my website, you will also get this amazing stencil included, or as a bonus, um, to all the other great things you get in your kit. So let me know if you have questions about that. And Oh, let's see who else is on. Kimberly, Deborah. Deborah, I think you were, um, if you watched my video from Sunday, I think you were one of my winners for the Craft My Stash uh, challenge. Um, if you commented on that, go look at it. Look at your YouTube notifications. You should have, you should see a comment from me. So Deborah Pierce, that's you I'm talking to. So send me an email. Rachel. Hi from San Francisco. Hey, Bunny. Heather. I'm seeing some new names. How many of you are on live with me for the first time? Hey, Stacy. Let me know if this is your first time joining us on a Thursday night live. Cindy Jones. Welcome. Welcome. I'm going to say I'm a little tired. Okay, what's your real name, F Perf one Marie, hi. Katie, first time. Yay. How'd you guys find me? I'd love to know that. Rachel, it's your first time. Hopefully you're here and interested in some projects with Magnolia Design Company. My Thursday night lives. Oh, hey, Pam. <laughs> My Thursday night lives are exclusively Magnolia. Okay. Um, my YouTube videos on Sunday are might have one or two stencil projects in them, but they're also general like budget home decor DIYs. So um, as we're getting started here, my name is Cindy. You're on my channel, Monarch Mom DIY. In uh, towards the end of October, I found Magnolia Design Company and um, I wanted to try the product out and I just started sharing it um, on my YouTube channel a little bit and people really hopped on. Uh, my team has grown. I have about over 80 people now on my team just since October. So we are Team Magnolia Monarchs. I'm excited to go to our first in-person convention at the beginning of August. Um, and because of all of you that have purchased and all of you that have signed up to join my team, I earned an incentive trip for both my husband and I plus our airfare in September. So yay! I love Magnolia. I love the company. I would love to answer any questions you have about it. But what I love most about it 
is it is for everyone, whether you think you are crafty or not so crafty, but you want to be crafty. So tonight I have uh, two or three main objectives. One, I wanted to share with you the sign up bonus that is tonight only. You get an amazing, um, hi Linda, an amazing creator enrollment kit for $69. It has almost $200 worth of product. But tonight, if you join our team, you're also going to get this Faith Family Freedom stencil. It's eight and a half by 11. It's what I used to make this round. And then I added some uh, star buttons from Walmart. And this is just using red and blue chalk paste. Hey, Nancy, you know I'm in Michigan too, right? So that was my first objective. If you thought about joining Magnolia either to build a business, to make a little extra money, or just to get a discount on your products, check that out. Go to my website, which is in the description, and then click on Become a Creator, and you can read all about it. So that's the signing bonus for tonight. I know one person already has taken advantage of that to join our team. Before I go on any further, if you are here and you love Monarch Mom and you love Magnolia, please give this video a thumbs up. That helps YouTube show it to more people. My second objective is we are going to do a simple project. I'm gonna, I've been doing some more elaborate projects, but tonight I just needed to show how simple Magnolia can be and how versatile. So we're gonna do a project. But before we do that, I have a sneak peek. Woo! of the July Craft Club kit. Where are my Craft Club people at? Let me know in the comments. Say Craft Club. If you don't know what Craft Club is, it is a monthly subscription. We ask that you commit to at least three months before you cancel. Um, after that, you can cancel, um, but it is such a great deal. Hi from Italy. Oh, I'm, I can't even try to say your name. Gazeli. Was that close? <laughs> You'll have to let me know. Anyway, I just received this. Okay, Lila, uh, I remind me to answer that question. Yes, this is our July Craft Club. So cute. There is a little video that shows them using the three wooden spoons, and they used um, these three stencils on the bottom, Farm Fresh, the Cow, and the Chicken. Does anybody else have a problem on the sound? You're the first person to say that. So I'm wondering if it's something not on my end. Let me know. Is the sound okay on my end? What do you mean no? No problem, Cindy? Let me make sure. Did I get louder? Oh. Sound is breaking up for some people, but it's good for others. Is it making noise now? Uh, I was pushing the, um, hmm, I don't see any glitching on my end. So I'm not sure what that could be. Okay. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. So hopefully, um, it'll be good. But here is the July Craft Club kit. Some of the other stencils, you get some, it's called Kitchen Minis. Yeah, I think it's just when I touched my iPad. I think we're good now. Um, kitchen mini Stencil. It's a brand new exclusive stencil. You cannot order this by itself. It is only available in this July Craft Club kit. So, um, if you saw the June Craft Club kit, the tote bag, um, it's way over there. Otherwise, I would bring it over and show you. Tonight is your last chance to get in on the June Craft Club kit. Otherwise, if you want this one and you have not already joined, tomorrow morning is when you're going to want to go to my website and click on Craft Club. So you get this 8.5 by 11 kitchen minis. has 12 mini stencils. Um, kiss the cook. Shake it up. Life is short, lick the spoon, whip it good, just roll with it. What's that one say? Uh, just beat it. I like the bless this kitchen. Hmm. I'm not sure, Gloria. My picture is perfectly clear on my iPad, so I'm wondering if maybe it's your internet? Sorry. Maybe come back and try to watch it when it's not live, if it's bothering you a lot. 
Um, then you also get the three wooden spoons. You get some black and white gingham ribbon. You get your squeegee and you get black chalk paste sample packet. $19.99. And I believe the shipping is like $5 and a quarter. Flat rate. And then like if you order tomorrow, your process, your payment will process. And then, um, and then in a couple days it'll ship. Cindy, I'm not sure what uh-oh means. Um, and then the next month, August, it'll process on the first again, and then it'll ship a couple days later. So it'll keep recurring on um, the same, pretty much the same day of the month, unless it's a weekend. Then it'll do it either right before or right after. So I'm super excited. Now, if you are part of the craft club, or if you're going to join it, we're going to do something new this month on July 15th. It's a Friday. Um, we're going to get together over Zoom and we're going to craft our July craft kit together. So um, take a look at my Facebook page and um, let me know if you want to join us for that. All right. So. The project I want to make, really simple. I want to use this stencil. I've had it for a little while. Perhaps you were created for such a time as this. This is from the story of Esther in the Bible. And did you know, did you realize that this story never talks about God? Never mentions the name God. Yet, if for believers, we can look at that story and see how God was orchestrating all of these things in Esther's life to basically rescue the, the Jewish people from um, being annihilated. So anyway, I feel like we all kind of go through times in our life where we're kind of wondering, why why am I having to go through this? Why am I here right now? Why, why has God put me in this place? And so I just want to show you how easy it is to stencil um, with our stencils, and I'm actually going to use a surface that is not from Magnolia. You can do that. This one happens to be from Hobby Lobby um, a couple few weeks ago. All of their wood things, unfinished wood, were 50% off, and so I grabbed this, I think, for like $7. It's, um, it's pretty large. Let's see. It's about, I'd say it's about 14 inches this way. Yeah, and about 10 inches this way. So we're going to use this 8.5 by 11 stencil. We're going to use a few colors of chalk paste. And I'm just going to show you how easy these products are to use. So let me angle you down so you can see my workspace. All right, and I'll kind of put it towards you so you can see it right side up. All right, and here is our stencil. Oh, I forgot to show you when I was talking about the July Craft Club kit. Um, these are our mini cutting boards that Magnolia also sells. I believe they come in a three pack. These kitchen minis would be super cute on here too with a little ribbon that you could give like as little gifts or you could sell them in a craft show. I think I'm going to make some of these too with some of these, these other ones. So that was just another little idea about that. Okay. So with our stencil, because we're stenciling on something other than fabric, we have to fuzz our stencil. And all that means is we're going to use this tacky towel that you can also get from Magnolia. It's, I think, less than $10. Because our stencil, I've not used this one yet, is pretty sticky. And we want to get a little of that stick off just so we're able to remove the stencil from our surface without stretching it okay we don't want to stretch the stencil because then our image would not be how it's supposed to be so we do this a few times you don't have to use the tacky towel it's just very convenient you could do it on a cotton t-shirt i could do it here on my magnolia apron that also comes in your kit, by the way. All right. You know what I forgot to do is I forgot to get water. Oh, well. I'll rinse it real quick after the live is done. 
All right, so we're going to center this as best we can here. It's okay that a little bit of the green part of the stencil corners are sticking off because we're not stenciling there anyway. All right, and then we're gonna carefully press our stencil down. We don't want any air bubbles. We want it nice and tight against our surface so that our paste just goes where the mesh is, where you see white right now, okay? All right, I haven't seen any more comments for a little bit. Are you guys still with me? Did I freeze? I hope I didn't freeze. All right, I think what I want to do is I want to do purple for the flowers and magnolia green. Oh, sorry, it's a pansy is this color. Magnolia green for the stem and the leaves. And I really like these two colors together. So I think I'm gonna do Tiffany teal for these two cursive words. And then what do you guys think for these words? Should I do the pansy again, like I'm doing the flower, or should I do black? Let me know what you think. Okay, should I do pansy or black for you were for such a time as this and the Esther 414? Let me know what you think. I know I love pansy too. All right, so let's start, let's see here. Let's start with pansy. And, all right, I got one vote for black for those words. I'm gonna use my a small cut apart squeegee. All right, and you just need the tiniest little bit. And you're just gonna go gently over those spots on the stencil. Ooh, black pansy, black, 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 black. Okay, so we'll do black for that. I do wanna work a little quickly because I don't want my paste to dry in my stencil before I lift it up. You guys excited tomorrow's Friday? I sure am, especially with the, the long weekend, the holiday weekend, celebrating Independence Day. Okay, all right, there's my, there's my flowers. Let's come in and do the green. We're just gonna do everything else up here. I'm gonna have to, um, get one of my little paintbrush squeegees to get in there between between those flowers and I'll show you what that looks like. I love chalking or stenciling. Okay. All right, so right in here, you can see there's some little stems, but they're so close that I'm gonna use this. Can you see it? It's a little paintbrush squeegee. So it's got a paintbrush handle, but a little tiny squeegee. And you know what? It's okay. I'm gonna get a little purple on here, but it's all right. I am not worried about it. Okay, there's our purple and our green. Let's get our teal just for these couple of words. Okay, we've got created. And perhaps. And now let's do the other words. Um, I would lay the stencil back down and go back over it is what I would do if it dried before I finished. Okay. 
Okay. All right, let's do the peel and reveal. Still super sticky, even though we fuzzed it. So I just go slowly. Oh, this is gonna look so nice. <gasps> ah, what do you guys think? I know the picture might be, is the picture backwards? Like, are the words backwards for you? I know sometimes on Facebook that happens. What do you guys think? I love it. I love it. What do you guys think? Is anybody there? I am really happy. Look at how crisp of a stencil that is. That is so detailed. Yes. Oh, it's not backwards. Okay, very good. I love this. All right, guys. So that is just how easy it is to make beautiful art using our stencils and our chalk paste um, or ink if you're wanting to do something on fabric. Let me know if you have any questions. Um, if any of you hopped on late, um, I did have a couple announcements. I did show what our July Craft Club kit is that's available starting tomorrow. Now, if you've already joined Craft Club, you don't have to do anything. You'll automatically get this one about on the same day of the month that you normally do, okay? But if you have not joined our craft club yet and you want to, you're going to want to, this I'm pretty sure is going to sell out before the end of the month. So if you want in on this kit, $19.99 plus $5 and some change for shipping, and then you'll get it, um, and then you'll get it uh, each month, um, unless after three months you want to cancel. But I am, I'm really loving these kits. They're always so different. Um, sometimes it's a surface, sometimes it's a beaded garland, a book stack, um, a fabric. Yeah, for sure, Brenda. This one's gonna, like I said, it might sell out. The other one that sold out was like November or December. I can't remember what it was. I think it was before I was doing Craft Club. But anyway, this is Craft Club. Um, if you've been thinking about possibly joining as a creator, either just to get the discount or to make a little extra money. Um, Magnolia is throwing in this stencil extra on top of all the other amazing things you get in your kit. If you join tonight by midnight Eastern time, the Faith Family Freedom Stencil, which I used to make this a while back. And what was the other thing? Oh, July 15th, we're going to get together on Zoom to make our July Craft Club kit. If you don't have yours by then, that's okay. Still join us. We'll share ideas. It'll be a lot of fun. So look for information on this in our, um, I think I put it on the Monarch Mom DIY Craft Club Facebook group. So one more look at our pretty, and this took literally less than five minutes, I would say. So nice. I think I might take this to work and hang it in my cubicle. All right, guys, I know this was a short live. Please email me if you have any questions about Craft Club or signing up as a creator. It's just monarchmomdiy at gmail.com. And I hope everyone has a wonderful night. I will have a video Sunday. Um, it is a holiday weekend, so it may be a little shorter. But FYI, oh, Bunny, this is from Hobby Lobby. And it came with the beads painted like this and everything. This was painted like this. I didn't do anything to it other than take the sticker off the back. And actually, you could paint the back and do another stenciled image on this side too. Um, be on the lookout for Christmas in July. That's all I'm going to say. Okay? Christmas in July. All right, guys. We'll see you soon. Bye.